Hey YouTube, Gone Girl with another video. So I know I haven't made a video in some time now. That's because I was sick for like uh, four or five days. And I, I didn't even play a while at all, so I've been feeling pretty bad, but I'm all good now. And so that's pretty much why I haven't been making, or haven't had a video in like a week. I have a lot of footage, like a ton of footage. So I'm gonna have like probably like three more videos after this one come out. So yeah, that's what it is. So so all this footage is from like a week ago, pretty much. <coughs> so this is um well one of the one of my guildies um, said that he was doing a weekly, and he, there's a quest with it that gave you emblems of triumph and emblems of frost. So I said okay, I'll go. Since I'm DPS, and this is my first time ever running this. I have no idea what the name of the instance is. I think it's the Eye of Eternity. I think that's what they called it. And you're fighting Malagos, this big blue dragon. It was a pretty cool fight. And, yeah, the first time we wiped, I don't know what happened. We were so close to it, we had, like, so little health left. But, yeah, I don't know. It just, we didn't do it, but... So the second time we killed him, and uh, we only had a couple of people die, but mainly it was good. And on the DPS charts, if you look in the red, I'm second on DPS. And it's pretty sad for all the DPSers, because my gear score is only like 4.3, I think. Everybody else is in like 5k and 4.9k and above. So that's that's pretty bad for them. That's like horrible. That means I, mean, I just did pretty good. <laughs> But for them, that's pretty sad. But yeah. So that's pretty much it. This boss, I didn't get any good. I didn't get any good uh, loot for myself. Uh, didn't get any upgrades from this boss. But yeah, there wasn't any really good loot. All I dropped was like leather and uh, this stuff with agility. That's it's like if you see a bunch of druids with this stuff. I forgot the name of it though. It, it looks pretty cool though, but yeah. So this was uh, the next day after Malagos. Uh, we ran Ani, Ani 10. And this was with uh, mainly guildies. We had seven of the guild members. The rest were just people that we picked up. And this fight is really interesting. Like, I thought it was going to be easy. Cause that's what they said it was, but it, it actually is somewhat complicated if your group is not good. Cause I, I like most of the raids that I'm doing now, I've never done before, so most of the time I have to have someone explain the fights to me, or else like, well, I'm not gonna know the fights, but yeah. So this is the first part of Ani 10. So when you get in the room, he's laying on the ground, and you wanna have one tank just run out there, pull him to the back room like it is here. And wait till he gets like a couple hits and you know get the aggro. Then all the DPSers, what you want to do is stand on the side of him in between like where his stomach is. Because if you stand in the uh, the back of him, his tail's gonna whiplash what you saw earlier. It's just gonna whiplash you back and he does a lot of damage and then you're just gonna wipe eventually or die. So that's what you want to do. That's like the first phase. This is the second phase. What you want to do is have uh, the tanks just pull the adds and if you have AoEs just have them aoe the adds down and like what you want to watch out because ani's going to be flying around then i have, he has like this breath where he flies across and breathes fire across like a whole like skinny stretch of the part if you're in that fire it does a whole bunch of damage and you can wipe easily with the group so what you want to do because it, it does have a warning you'll say um ani is uh takes in a deep breath that's when you run to the sides of the cavern the very sides of it and then just stay there and then yeah just keep uh, taking ads down until it comes back down like this and then this is pretty much like the first phase of the fight in the beginning just have dps on the sides and dps until he's dead so it, it's, it's actually it's a pretty fun instance it's pretty fast too like it there's not a whole bunch of killing other mobs before you get to him it's like a i think like four or five mobs you kill before you get to him so 
yeah, it's not too complicated. And I had fun running it too. I think the DPS for me in this one was like, uh, I was in two point something K. It wasn't that good DPS. Like usually I had around like 2.9, 3 point, like 2.9 to 3.1, like around there. <coughs> so it was okay. And they had the this big bag drop. It was a 22 slot, and I lost the roll. I was so mad because I, I really wanted that bag. And they also dropped a bag of jewels, which had some pretty good gems in it that was going to sell for a lot. Didn't get that either, which sucked. Yeah. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for this video. I ran the weekly with Mallow Ghost, downed him. Didn't get good loot, but I got uh, money... And I got uh, five emblems of frost and five emblems of triumph, which is pretty good. I can use that to upgrade equipment, you know. And then I ran ran uh, Ani Ten, which is my first time doing both of them. Uh, I'd say I like uh, the Malagos fight better. I mean, it, I, I, I enjoyed it more. It was much more fun. But both were fun. But yeah, the other one's better. And. So as I said before, you know, I haven't made videos because I was sick and all, but uh, expect a lot more videos coming out. And I might uh, have videos of Allods, Allods Online, because it's in open beta, and I have it downloaded. I've been playing it a little bit, not that much. I think I'm like level 9, but yeah. Anyways, yeah, but I might make videos of that. I'm not sure yet if I should. If you guys want to see that, then I'll make videos of it. If you don't, if you want to just see about WoW videos, then I'll just stick to WoW videos. Um, but yeah. So, that's pretty much it. Also, I do have a new, uh, I'm leveling a new character. I have my Druid that I'm leveling, like you guys seen. Also, I have uh, a Pally now. Pretty much, because the AD I did have, my first AD was a Pally, and I didn't get to play with him that much, and I really liked him. So I'm leveling another one, try to get him to 80. And he has two uh, BOA gears. He's leveling pretty quickly. He's like level t He's around like 18 right now, I believe. And yeah, he, he's going to be... I'm going to have a video of him pretty soon too. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe, rate, and comment, please. And I'll see you in the next video, which probably will be a Pally video, most likely. So yeah, thank you for watching, everybody. Have a good day.